going on guys? Miranda from Student Aesthetics. We out here in the Gold Coast, collabing with my man Igor. First of all, today we're gonna hit the gym, obviously. Chest workout, right? Chest workout, chest effort free. Chest workout, so he's gonna take me through his routine, and I'm gonna show you guys, let's do it. Alright y'all, so we finished our workout there. For me, it was so freaking awesome. First of all, to train with Igor, obviously. Have a little bit of competition. He uh, slightly outbenched me today. I really miss these workouts because I've been doing like full body nowadays. Uh, full body is fun, like you progress a lot, but um, you don't get that pump that you get with these workouts, right? You have to pull the shirt out, this is flexing. I love the, like, the, the workouts like this, like when you're doing a split, even if it's yeah. upper lower or push pull legs, or theoretically if you're doing a row split, you just get that pump and yeah. you get that volume and you truly feel like a bodybuilder. Yeah, you yeah, feel, you feel, you like, feel a like you know you're yeah, Arnold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Except yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a little bit heavier than him in weight, but the interesting thing is there's a difference, right? I mean, you've got intensity, you've got frequency, you've got volume, you've, you've even got speed of the workout. So I was going a little bit heavier, but like you know I was taking a little bit longer rest periods. There was multiple times when he'd be like, "All right, like no, come on, let's move to the next one." I'm still kind of like, Duh. so yeah, 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 I've got like you know an extra five, five, ten pounds worth of strength. But there's a reason, right? It comes at a price. I'm sitting here just like, I gotta chill for four minutes and recover from my next set. I actually wanted to ask Igor like a little bit on your like opinion on like natural lifting. I've done a lot of videos about this uh, because you're obviously a science guy. So. Yeah, somewhat, somewhat. Yeah, maybe give like a few tips for the people out there that um, you don't want to get into lifting. Natural, okay. Um, so my ba the basics, that, that is my what I believe in, the basics. I've yeah. got so many people who, especially like, I work with clients all over the world. And so usually when people come to me, they are somewhat new. We're talking their first one to two years of lifting or potentially no years at all. They're just starting, they're just starting, you know, they're just starting out. If someone's been lifting for a while and they know what they're doing, chances are they're okay and they're not gonna acquire the assistance of a coach such as myself or student aesthetics. Right. But when people come to me, they know they are kind of new to it. One of the problems I see is their minds are filled with so much crap. Yeah. And it's not, it's not your fault if any of you are watching, it's not their fault. It's because the media and social media and TV and you know, you're sitting at home, you see all these like infomercials bombarding you with all this useless, ridiculous knowledge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're telling you all these ridiculous things. One of the reasons behind this, and this is my opinion, and it may not be a very popular opinion, I think fitness and nutrition is very simple in concept. It's difficult in execution, right? I could sit here and tell you eat chicken and you know, like clean foods and do cardio, and it's simple. Right. Calories in, calories out. For you to actually do that and actually get the mind, uh, the, the willpower to do it, it's difficult in execution. So, so many people come to me and their minds are clouded. So, the first thing I do when I start working with the client, before I even tell you anything new, I need to clear your mind of all this crap, right? You need to forget everything that you've been told over the past couple of years. So we need to start all over. 10% of it is yeah, good, yeah, but yeah. the rest of it, there's so much stuff and it's like, this is, it's just like fluff. Literally, get in the gym, do basic, you know, compact exercises. We work with stuff like the bench press, incline bench press. Yeah, we, yeah, we do some crazy, you know, crazy, interesting cable movements and machine movements. We do a couple of isolation lifts. Yeah, insane. but it's simple. When you're a young guy, especially if you're like 16, 17, 18, or you know, not even 80, you can be 30, 40, I don't care, but you're just starting out, stick to the basics. Eat good, wholesome food. Don't worry about supplements too much yet. You know, just get in the gym, get in the kitchen, lift, you know, lift heavy, basic compound exercises, eat protein, get eat stronger. wholesome meals. Yeah. That's it, guys. It's simple. Keep it simple, guys. That's it, guys. Simplicity is key. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Alright, so we're having some food here, post-workout meal. I got chicken, honey chicken, and uh, rice. Yeah, chicken teriyaki, rice veggies, uh, pretty standard. I mean, like, the only bad part of it is probably, like, it's cooked in oil, but screw it. I mean, that's not a big deal at all. It's better than, like, like going like KFC, where it's, like, not just cooked in oil, it, it's, like, deep-fried in oil. So, pretty clean. We, we ordered extra chicken, but they kind of, like, gypped us on it, so... We kind of, like, uh, we, we kind of, like, oh, you know, can you, can you please, sir, can I have some more? About to head to this mall. It's supposed to be pretty cool, right? It's a really nice mall. I'm from Toronto, which is a third biggest city in all of North America, and we don't have a single mall that's as nice as this. Really? At least in my opinion. It's the nice, it's half oh. outdoors, half indoors. There's like 
fountains, there's like, a it's incredible. Let's see, man. And we need some new clothes anyway. Probably some shoes. And we pretty much ran out of clothes, actually. So, uh, yeah. Gonna be cool. Look at nah, the whole nah, tray. Nah, the whole tray. Holy yeah. shit! Twelve dollars for real? Minutes? I don't know. I, I think it'd be that really. I think it'd be, I think it'd be a really good video. Because <laughs> it's like it's not a crazy amount of food, but twelve minutes is like. I know you. You're gonna go through four in like a second. But then it's like the last couple ones is gonna. Yeah, uh, exactly. That is you. I'll say twelve dollars in twelve minutes. Do it. Calories this are gonna be about four thousand calories. It's about three hundred each. But Eat also, today. dude, we're drinking tonight. I don't want you to get like. I don't want you to puke twelve donuts everywhere. That's true. We are drinking. Let's fucking do it, man. Do it? Fuck right. it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Golden key is what you want to get into the box. So once you've lined it up, you hold that down. And once you let go of that, once you hold it down, it will start moving up. And you let go and it shoots forward and you want to get it into the box. So just move. Yeah. There we go. Uh, no. Bruh. Oh, man. <laughs> you keep on going? <laughs> We were in the store, was like showing us stuff, and he was like, I recognize oh, I you, guys. I know you. So, yeah, super cool. So I'm like, I know you, man. Yeah, I know you, man. Yeah, yeah, sure. yeah. All good, man. Thanks. I'm glad you got my phone, man. I got a photo with you. Yeah, sure. Come on. What's up, Beast? We were gonna fuck with you. What's up? Yeah. How are you? Uh, I'm great now, though. <laughs> <laughs> what we're gonna do now is, um, you know, we're student aesthetics, meeting up with Igor. He hasn't been drinking alcohol for like, for like what? This has been a while. It's probably the first time in eight months. Eight, eight months. Eight, seven months. Literally since like last New Year's, maybe. That's insane. And um, he is willing to do it with me, so that that's like a great honor for me. So um, what I'm gonna do is take him through the student aesthetics experience. You guys already know what it is, man. This has been the thing ever since I started student aesthetics. We kept a Morgan, and then we mix it with Coke Zero, because that's how we roll. We, we got a lot of cans here, right? Check it out. So uh, we got enough air to fill up with the for tonight. Uh, but it's gotta be awesome. And then again, this is obviously really not optimal, like suboptimal, because I did that challenge like this afternoon. But um, yeah, the challenge was completely fucking random, so I didn't actually like no I was gonna do it so you guys are maybe wondering like how do you make up for the challenge because I am actually gonna make up for the challenge you can do it uh, macros is not necessarily about your daily intake but more so about your weekly intake so what I'm gonna do now like after that meal today um, the, the food challenge I didn't have any food all right they have some dinner here I skipped out because I just simply wasn't hungry so I'm not gonna eat anything anymore uh, just gonna like drink alcohol right now and that will also like give me even more calories and then in the next two days, I'm pretty much gonna be cutting slightly. So I'm gonna go on like a cutting diet, um, cutting macros basically, and then to make up for the fat intake and the carb intake that I had today. And I'm pretty much fine, you know. I think like after one day of cutting, I would be fine, but I'm just gonna do like very, very slight cuts. So I'm just gonna cut out some carbs, probably just cut out meal one and do intermittent fasting again. So we're, we're working on this Captain Morgan here. Um, we're pretty much shooting like uh, we, we did a video for his channel on like drinking alcohol my opinion on it And right now we're gonna record a Q&A when we're drunk So he's trying to get a little bit more drunk because he isn't drunk yet. I'm getting there. Look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, look, look at this. He's having <laughs> <laughs> Drunk physique <laughs> Okay, so we're about to leave and then Avil told me like, hey bro, we gotta actually like end the vlog, so that's what I'm gonna do right now. We're about to go out. We're gonna go out with my man Igor, man. This is this is the perfect bro, man. First finish this bottle, then head out, and I hope you guys... We're not gonna take you guys with me, right? We're not uh, gonna take you with me. We might like Snapchat once or twice, but that's it. We might like Snapchat, so make sure to follow us there, right? I'll put it on the screen, and uh, make sure to check out his channel as well if you're interested in seeing more videos. Absolutely. We're absolutely sober! Yes, indeed we are. We're gonna go to this best... <sighs> Um, the, the flexible dieting and flexible dieting and the nutritional approach towards hypertrophy, hypertrophy, hypertrophy. <laughs> <laughs> Skeletal muscle growth. Skeletal muscle growth, sarcoplasmic muscle. Fuck! He used to be the size guy. Like, I used to be the size Where's guy. Where's the size at, bro? <sighs>
With that said, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like the video. Make sure to give him a follow. Make sure to subscribe to the channel as always. See you guys tomorrow, all right? Because we're doing daily vlogs every single freaking day. Nabil's actually gonna finish up this vlog right now, all right? So I gotta give him credit for that. If he's done, he may actually join us on a night out. So he's a, he's a fucking legend for finishing it. I'm gonna finish this bottle instead of finish a vlog. Is that cool? <laughs> yeah, that is cool. That is cool. I appreciate it, man. <laughs>